From VOA Learning English, this is the science report. The number of buses, taxis, and other vehicles on Kenya's roads is growing every day. Now, the country's first electric-powered motorbike is being made. The bike is designed to cut down on pollution and is aimed at low-income communities. Most motorbikes used in Kenya depend on gasoline as fuel. But this motorbike uses energy from sunlight. Three university students developed the new Ecotran bike. It captures the sun's energy stores it in batteries, and uses it to charge the electric motor. Robert Achalget is one of the student inventors. He said the students hope to be able to cover the whole of Kenya with the electric motorcycle within a few years. We want to conserve the environment and provide affordable transport, he said. Electric power is unpredictable in Kenya. The students have set up a fueling station for the motorbikes in Nairobi. The bike's small battery can run for 70 kilometers when fully charged. Once that power is used up, the motorbike has to return to the fueling station while another charged battery is connected to the bike. The United States government's African Development Foundation is supporting the Ecotran idea. The agency is providing financing for two solar-powered charging stations in the Kenyan port of Kisumu. Each Ecotran bike costs about $700. One motorcycle taxi operator says the new bike costs less to operate than bikes running on traditional fuel. Ecotran plans to go to the market with 40 bikes in 2016. For VOA Learning English, I'm Ann Ball.